तो एवरी वन हाउ टू सिंप्लीफाई दिस नाइस एल्जब्राइक एक्सप्रेशन इन टू द सिंप्लीफाइड फॉर्म सो हेयर वी हैव फोर टू दावर ऑफ टेन माइनस टू टू दावर ऑफ टेन डिवाइडेड बाई फोर टू दावर ऑफ फाइव सो वी राइट दिस एल्जब्राइक एक्सप्रेशन इन टू द सिंप्लीफाइड फॉर्म विदाउट यूजिंग द कैलकुलेटर हेयर यू रिमेम्बर वन थिंग इज दैट calculator is not allowed in this problem it means that we will do all of the working on this paper or in our mind so i hope so you like this video and now i can solve this video by two methods uh, so uh, i hope so you like both of these methods but if you like uh, which method uh, you like please mention into the comment section and if you have any other method Uh, so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section so uh, in here we discuss uh, our first method uh, and now here in the first method uh, we need to focus in the base of this term uh, and we write our this base as because this is 4 we write 4 as 2 multiplied by 2 and its exponent is 10 minus this is 2 to the power of 10 divided by this is 4 and we write this four as 2 square and its whole power is 5 and now in the next step we need to apply here the exponent law uh, so here we need two exponents laws if you have a multiplied by b and its whole exponent is m we write it as a to the power of m multiplied by b to the power of m and we apply the second exponent law and that is if you have a to the power of m to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by n so here we need these two exponent laws uh, to move forward so first we can apply the first exponent law on here and it will be written as in this form so we have uh, 2 to the power of 10 multiplied by 2 to the power of 10 minus 2 to the power of 10 divided by here when you multiply this 2 with 5 it will be written as 2 to the power of 10 and now you see here we have this is 2 to the power of 10 and we will take common 2 to the power of 10 in the numerator term and it will be written as 2 to the power of 10 minus 1 and it is divided by 2 to the power of 10 so this 2 to the power of 10 is cancelled out by this 2 to the power of 10 and we get the remaining values are 2 to the power of 10 minus 1 so here our next claim is to find the value of 2 to the power of 10 and at the last we subtract it with minus 1 so first we find the value of 2 to the power of 10 and we write this 10 as 2 to the power of 5 plus 5 and we again apply the exponent law and we apply these two terms separately on 2 and it will be written as 2 to the power of 5 multiplied by 2 to the power of 5 and we know that 2 to the power of 5 equals to 32 multiplied by 32 so here we break this 32 as 30 plus 2 and now we multiply this 32 on these two values it will be written as 32 multiplied by 30 plus 32 multiplied by 2 so here you see that this is one digit number this is two digit number when you multiply 0 with 32 you get 0 when you multiply 3 with 32 you get 3 2 6 6 and 3 3 are 9 plus here you multiply 2 2 are 4 and 2 3 are 6 so now we need to sum up these two values 0 plus 4 is 4 6 plus 6 is 12 we write 2 and carry 1 9 plus 1 is 10 so we get here 2 to the power of 10 equals to 1024 so now here uh, we get uh, this expression here uh, this is 2 to the power of 10 minus 1 it will be written as uh, 2 to the power of 10 is equals to 1024 minus 1 so when you subtract it with 1 it will be written as 1000 and 23 so this is the our final simplified form of the given question and this is the final answer which we get here into the first method and now uh, we move forward uh, into the second method and we again solve this problem so here uh, first uh, we can write here our second method and uh, in second method first we can uh, first we just copy down the given question statement here 
the given question statement is that 4 to the power of 10 minus 2 to the power of 10 divided by 4 to the power of 5 so here we again let's simplify this expression uh, with uh, without using the calculator and uh, with method number 2 and i hope so you like both of these methods so uh, first uh, you see here uh, here in this method uh, i can just break this fraction and i can write uh, this term separately on uh, 4 to the power 5 separately on both of these values it will be written as 4 to the power of 10 divided by 4 to the power of 5 minus 2 to the power of 10 divided by 4 to the power of 5 and here we can apply uh, the two uh, exponent laws but now here i can write these exponent in the next step so first you we write this term as it is 4 to the power of 5 divided by 4 to the power of 10 divided by 4 to the power of 5 minus this is 2 to the power of 10 divided by this is 4 to the power of 5 and we write it as 2 square and its whole exponent is 5. And now uh, in the next step we uh, need two exponent laws here. First we apply this exponent law if you have a to the power of m divided by b to the power of m uh, sorry divided by a to the power of n. So it is equals to a to the power of m minus n. And now the second law which we need here if you have a to the power of m to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by n. So first we can apply here this exponent law on the first term and this exponent law in the second term so it will be written as here we move this exponent 5 to the upside and it will be written as 4 to the power of 10 minus 5 and here uh, these two exponents are multiplied by each other and it will be written as a 2 to the power of a 2 5 is a 10 so you see here this uh, 2 to the power of 10 is cancelled out by this 2 to the power of 10 and here we have 4 to the power of 10 minus 5 becomes 5 and here we have minus 1 so now here our next target is to find the value of 4 to the power of 5. 4 to the power of 5 means that we multiply 4 with 5 times uh, in this way. So you see here 4 4 is a 16 uh, and 16 times of uh, 4 becomes here uh, 64. 6 6 uh, 6 uh, 4 4 is a 16. 16 4 is a 64 and again 4 4 is a 16 so now we multiply 64 with 16 and we write this 16 as 10 plus 6 so uh, when you multiply 64 with 10 you get 640 and when you multiply this 64 with 6 you get here 6 uh, 6 4 is a 24 we write 4 and carry 2 6 6 is a 36 36 plus 2 becomes 38 and now we sum up these two values so 0 plus 4 is 4 8 4 plus 8 is 12 we write 2 and carry 1 6 plus 3 is 9 9 plus 1 is 10 so it means that 4 to the power of 5 equals to 1024 and now we move backward and we uh, we write this term as we have 4 to the power of 5 minus 1 it means that 1024 minus 1 so it is equals to 1023 so this is the our final answer of this problem uh, and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos